Uh, it's a autonomous uh, body of uh, government of Punjab which works uh, in the domain of geospatial support to the various government user department whereas uh, the department of space is being the our technical leader and we work in tandem on the various national level mission mode projects and at the state level we basically provide the uh, solutions and the services to the uh, various uh, government bodies and also we are now developing the state level like we heard about the state data infrastructure special infrastructure development program where we are now um, uh, working towards mapping the Punjab's future uh, how the various uh, different kinds of layers or uh, data which we are generating for various departments like education health agriculture and these uh, data's will put into one single platform wherever all the user departments can access this information. Uh, we are also in line with the uh, various uh, national level uh, key initiatives by the government of India as our Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi has announced about digital uh, India, smart cities, Swaksha Bharat. So these where we are already there in the uh, fray. Also the providing the support to the um, farmers by the mobile mapping, GIS mapping, putting together in all and in apart from this we are also doing various research and uh, intensive uh, things and the uh, the areas which is very very uh, um, contemporary like climate change we are hearing and then as you must be heard that uh, Punjab Haryana in for last couple of years there was a news that the farmers are burning their uh, crop residues after harvesting which is causing very very uh, uh, damaging aspects for the environment so we are now uh, mapping all those uh, fire burns by the farmers to identify the areas as a government has already uh, put a law in place that those who are doing this and violating the norms they will be booked and uh, they will be taken uh, due action will be taken against those things but uh, we as a government we doesn't want to be believe just uh, giving a punishment or the penalty we are also taking this as a inputs to chalk out the various plans uh, to educate the farmers look this is not a uh, in the interest of you as it's uh, also impacting the health of the soil it's not giving uh, the any output out of it also the uh, environment is affecting very badly and this year if I, if I can see that for last two years this study we are doing for the Punjab Pollution Control Board and, uh, and as a team and uh, in this two years of things uh, if i take the benefit of uh, this study is that the this year itself within a range a gap of one year the uh, fire burning has come down by 38 percent so closely you can say um, because we are now finalizing our reports maybe it may be about between 35 to 40 percent come down where various media houses also covered this uh, aspects and so this is helping the government helping the uh, government agents like PPCB and the more important is the last man this we call the farmer because they have to understand and they know that if is they are not going to spare if after educating them uh, government providing the, sub, uh, the solutions to them like they are giving a subsidy for buying the um, harvesters and buying the other things and also setting up the this particular study is now going to be uh, useful to set up the because we are talking about the uh, skill India and manufacturing India so we are now this data is going to use uh, by the industry also okay, look these are the problematic areas where farmers are having a uh, lot of uh, biomass available for the industries which they can use for the board like board uh, making uh, industries and even for the uh, f uh, fuel also so these are the various initiatives which have so come and uh, where the as a center as a solution provider to the government and various other uh, agencies and uh, we have taken up various some uh, research projects in along with the PAU where we are going to use the drone and uh, with drone we are now going toward the precision farming also we are also helping uh, identifying the areas where we can give them the pre -warn, uh, pre warning for the disease surveillance kind of things where if they're in pest pest attack or some other kind of thing so we are now
take up various key projects on the research side also along with the various uh, academic institutions uh, like PAU is one of them then also with the ISRO on these things. So with this uh, we are working uh, aggressively on that and hope in coming uh, not, not, not more but in uh, come two three years we will be in the very forefront of uh, using the geospatial technology in each and every sector of the departments. As uh, one more thing which I just want to touch upon of the smart cities. In Punjab, uh, we have identified the uh, Amritsar is a very much a worldwide uh, famous city uh, where we are now taking this is already in the Hirde project of the uh, Ministry of Rural Development and the Ludhiana and Jalandhar and Patiala, these are all in the fray, including the Chandigarh where we are going to help them for uh, things. We already have mapped the uh, data, uh, GIS data for Ludhiana and Batinda city. And uh, hopefully these cities may come under the smart cities and uh, we will be there to support them. Thank you.